Hey all here at OS Reviews, you're watching our hands-on review of the QuiFit K Sports headphones. The most interesting thing about these true wireless earbuds is they're advertised as in-ear personal trainers, so they have a heavy emphasis on sports and activity training. In fact, it comes with a companion app that you can download for iOS or for Android. It includes three months of unlimited service. So QuiFit uh, is a manufacturer of these sports-oriented earphones and headphones, and their previous uh, model, the QuiFit headphones, sold for $150, but I would estimate that it retails for around 50 to 80 bucks or so. Uh, taking a look at the packaging, it's quite simple. We have just a few of the different sports that it can track, including running, uh, biking, aerobics, uh, weightlifting, as well as just jogging, and it has a QR code you can scan to download the app. Specs on the back, it includes music playback up to three hours, so it's very typical as far as true wireless earbuds are concerned. It does not come with a battery case, uh, so in terms of charging, you do have to rely on a cable. You probably have to bring along your own power bank. So definitely not as delicate as some other of the more music-focused True Wireless earbuds I've been seeing on the market. So in the packaging here, we just have the earbuds themselves. We have the charging cable, which is using just micro USB because there's a standard port on both of these ear tips that you use to plug in to charge. Again, not as elegant as some of those magnetic pen-based designs we've been seeing. Aside from serving as a power key, once paired with the phone, you can also double tap on it to answer or reject a phone call. And on the bottom, we do have the micro USB port. Now, these are not going to be completely waterproof, so you can't submerge them in water, such as when you're showering or taking a swim, because again, there's nothing covering these up. Uh, they're not treated inside, but for splashes and for sweat, they should survive. Uh, they also don't have a larger wing that catches on the outside of your ears, which is, I think, a little disappointing for sports oriented earphones because if you constantly move your head around and shake they can still occasionally fa fall out uh, without something that catches externally when it comes to audio quality i'd say they are also very average as far as tws earbuds are concerned not a huge amount of bass but mid sound pretty good and they have insufficient volume so that even if you are in a crowded environment you can still hear it without any problems uh, occasionally it does, it does get out of sync if you're watching a, a video clip like on youtube the video and the audio tends to maybe have a split second delay if you play and pause the track very quickly that's very common for tws uh, technology especially something that's using version 4.1 uh, on Bluetooth version 5.0 devices, the technology has gotten even better. So it's a little disappointing that these, which have just been released a few days ago, in fact, they're still in the campaign stage, are using a slightly outdated form of Bluetooth. Luckily, the, the part that these are advertised as, which is that fitness coach part, is the strongest element of this particular product. There are various plans for all sorts of uh, sports segmented by, let's say, running marathons, half marathon, competitive 10K, and there's even things like cycling in addition to at-home uh, kind of workouts for gyms and weightlifting. So all these types of different uh, activities are segmented up top. And uh, at the same time, you can even look up uh, kind of real coaches. They actually are also recruiting coaches uh, consistently. It says earn about $50 an hour from any location. So again, their website seems to be quite active when it comes to supporting this entire ecosystem of sports and activities and constantly expanding on that. So that certainly is good to see. So going back into the app here, uh, we can take a look at our profile, which you first need to use an email to sign up. There is a redemption code for the three months of unlimited service that you get on the user manual printed on the back. So you enter that code in and you are ready to go for, uh, again, three months. And over here you can also tap, take a look at my plans, which are the plans that you have access to depending on your membership level. And uh, you don't need to pay anything else. You simply tap on these to download them, for instance, depending on the size of the plan, some of them which are audio-based, some of them which require a real person to guide you along. Uh, it may take a few moments. Tapping on a plan gives you more details about what type of training it's supposed to do. The author or the coach that you'll be talking to, you can contact it and also download it to learn more information. So now let's try one of the training plans. Uh, we're going to use this beginning running plan, but you are able to connect to another heart rate monitor if you have one, or the regular QuiFit headphones which came before these actually did have heart rate uh, tracking as one of the functions. And indeed it's just using your phone's data such as Google Maps to track your location on a map as well as your distance. So this uses GPS uh, service on your, on your phone. Now as you move depending on your speed in addition to where you are in kind of that running session, you're able to hear the audio coach in your so I'm going to put this very close by. I'm going to resume. Pace too slow. Day one. Introductory run. Interval one starting. We'll do a one kilometer warm up at a very easy intensity. At 
this intensity, you should feel like you're doing very little work. So as you can hear, it's going to be always kind of in your ear telling you what to do each step of the way. Um, and it's fairly accurate and effective, especially if you have a good kind of GPS chip on your phone so it's able to accurately detect your location, then you can get a pretty good uh, measurement of the speed that you're going at and it will tell you, you know, if you're going slowly, quick enough, or just at the right speed. So again, more statistics if you have something like a sensor also connected using Bluetooth. Other products we've reviewed include the Move, tried to do kind of the same thing, but this was more of a fitness tracker. It doesn't come with any in-your style headphones, but you could always use your own. And it also has an app which tells you your performance, such as you're going too slowly, things like that, which makes it interactive. So it's kind of in a different way of packaging it. This one as a fitness tracker, this one as earbuds, but they also have that interactive live coaching element. So whether this is worthwhile to you if you are just maybe beginning and trying to reach a fitness goal, uh, or if you're really into sports, you're into trying to create new challenges as well as to try out new activities, uh, you know, this product will fit different types of people. If you only want something for music listening, then these are probably not for you because they don't have the best audio quality, they don't have the most elegant design, and they're going to be overpriced if you only listen to music. So be sure to check out more details in the links down below if you are interested in these, but for now that's been our video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews, that's been the Quiet Fit K Sports True Wireless Earbuds.